I'm with Kingsway Power Under 12s after round four of the ENG Under 12s Youth Netball Premier League Northern Conference. Um, today you played Leeds, a team who were unbeaten like yourselves, six games, six wins. It was a good game, a stressful game, um, I can imagine. Before we talk about the game itself, do you, did you feel a lot more stressed than you normally would do before games before this one due to the build-up or did you come into it feeling quite confident and relaxed? Um, I think it was quite stressful because the scores kept on going up and down and... No, but before you actually started the game, how did you feel personally before the game? Um, I was a bit nervous but confident. Same for you too? Yeah. And you were confident but... It, your, it didn't really show in the first quarter your confidence because Leeds went into a, into a lead. Um, were you surprised or shocked at how well they were doing or was it a case of you, you kind of being potentially overconfident or a bit slack in your, in your preparation? What was it that gave Leeds the edge in that first quarter? Do you know? Uh, well, we know they're a good team. We played them before and we won against them, so, but lots of their players were gone. Yeah. So we were quite shocked, I guess. Um, what were they doing in the first quarter? Yeah, the first quarter in particular, what were they doing so well that gave them the edge over you? Communication, because they were communicating and we, were, we weren't shouting enough. I think their defence was quite good as well. Yeah. 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 And they were working hard to stop yours because you did. I'm actually lying. You did actually start well, but then they crept back into the game, yeah. and then went into the lead. So I'm, I was actually lying there. You actually started well, but then they slowly got back into the game. Do you do you feel? So you go into the second quarter and they win the second quarter as well. Is it, again was that because they were doing a great job at trying to isolate, especially Daisy? I think there was a focus to try and stop her receiving the ball as much as possible. Yeah. Do you believe that was the goal? Yeah. Just give me an insight into how you felt during the game. I think because um, she's like one of our main tutors, they were trying to stop her from like shooting so we wouldn't get as many goals as that. And in your general game playing that sec in the second quarter, um, again, they went in into the lead, into half time. Were you happy of your general match play? What, what was what was said at half time as uh, by your coaches? What were they trying to say you need to improve upon? We were throwing away too many balls and like doing too many errors. Yeah, too many like silly errors that we shouldn't be doing. Mm -hmm. And that was is that because of Leeds kind of shutting down your your potential um, um, players you're passing it to, or was it again nervousness? I think we were just like panicking because yeah. our score was we were like one ahead. Uh, one, one behind. Yeah. So we were just panicking and like throwing balls. Then the game went through like a period in a third quarter where no one wanted to score, no, no one wanted to pass the ball to each other, and it, you know every every single time it, there, there would be a mistake by someone, but you've eventually got got ahead in the game, but then you let Leeds back into it in the fourth quarter, yeah. potentially 15 seconds towards the end they had the ball in the attacking D. They could have taken the shot. They chose to pass. It didn't really pan out well for them. So you just got the win, 21-20. What does that show about your team winning by that fine margin? Does it show that you don't have to be on top of your game to win these big games? Or does it show, does it show more about how well Leeds did today? Um, it shows how well Leeds did today. Yeah. But you're qualified for the Nationals. Well done. So just a plus, but you don't look happy off that win. You're right. <laughs> no, because I'm going to look really sweaty on camera. They don't. This 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 takes it away. Yeah. Trust me. Is, it, there like, is there like a filter? Yeah. No, but it, it, it you, you won't notice it. <laughs> right. So you've qualified for nationals. You've got two games left, but the big one we we all want to see is the Oldham game. That's coming up on April the second. It's huge. It's it's big for the league. It, it tells us who the Northern champions are going to be. It also tells us who the top seed is going into the national finals. So, give us some feedback. Would that performance against Leeds beat Oldham? Mm. Mm. I'm not sure. Not. Mm. I don't really know. What do you need to improve then going into the Oldham game? Uh, what? Because we played Oldham in the very league, I think, and we lost because we got a bit 
like psyched out. Like, yeah. Oh my god, it's Oldham. Yeah. So I think we did that today. Yeah. And how do you, if if you've got, say again, we, we know how good Daisy is as a shooter. What if Oldham do that and then they they phase her out the game? Is it? Are you confident enough that you've got enough shooters in the, in this in the squad yeah, to we still? Have, yeah. We have really good shooters, so I will yeah. keep on playing our game and not get pulled into their game. And are you confident you can take on Oldham and beat them to the league title? Yeah. Yeah. Confident. <laughs> yes, <laughs> kind of. <laughs> but um, but you're qualified for the nationals. That's the main thing. Are you going to be interested to see how the Oldham game goes against Leeds? Based yeah. on the Leeds performance, are they going to give Oldham a good game, do you reckon? Is yeah. Leeds playing Oldham today? Yeah. Yeah? Do you reckon yeah. they give them a good game? Yeah. Cool. Well, do you want to wish Leeds good luck? <laughs> but, um, good luck. Good luck. But well done. You've qualified for the Nationals. You're going into the last round, potentially going to be champions, but you're going to have to get past Oldham in particular to get to, to win that. So um, well done. And um, we'll see you on April the 4th.